you have to stay in the race. I'm almost finished. Just to know that within the body of Christ, the, the problems here on earth is only temporary. It's temporary. Do you know that? Your lights may be out now, but by and by, when the morning comes, you gonna have some lights. Yeah. Heist up your windows, open up your doors. If you don't have no lights, open up those shades. You don't got no diamond backyard in your, in your house. So open up your shades. Let some sunlight in. See, I tell the people sometimes that when you're going through at home, you don't got no water. You don't got no electricity. Because you know, I found out that they'll cut you off down here before God know about it. But I'm just telling you, when the church doors open, you need to come on in. There's lights in the house. If you don't got no water, bring up the jug up to the church. Step to the bathroom or the kitchen. You fill it up with some water. Go back home. You can brush your teeth. Wash your private parts. But we want to stay at home because we got some pride. Come on. I'm still fighting a good fight. Come on. My course, I'm still heaven bound. Because I have heaven in my view. I don't know about you. I got heaven in my view. Because I know that God has my back. And I know I'm still standing. No matter what come or go, I'm still standing. I'm on the press toward the mark of the high calling within Jesus Christ. This is temporary. I'm just a pill passing through. I'm just passing through. That's all I'm doing, church. That's all you doing. But it's passing through. And in the midst of passing through, we have to keep it holy. We have to keep it holy. Without holiness, there is nothing. We have to keep it holy. I tell people, no matter you Baptist, Church of God in Christ, Free Will Baptist, Come Methodist, on. United Methodist, Seventh-day Adventist, Come on. all the rest of them that go on along with it, you've got to keep it holy. You can't, you can't answer to nobody. You can't answer to God for nobody but yourself. I don't care how many skeletons you got in your closet. I don't care how many times you say, I'm going to take this to my grave. You can take whatever you want to your grave. But I only know and seen one person that had a hearse behind a coffin. That was Liberace. He, but that casket, them diamond rings, that big glass piano is going in the ground. But it ain't going to heaven. His soul is going to take either heaven or hell. I'm not going to judge you because I don't know what kind of life that is. But that's the only time I've ever seen a moving truck. Behind our hearts. But you can't take all that to heaven. Your soul won't go to heaven. And you can't you can't go before God and say, Well, God, this is what I meant. Jesus, can you go to the Father for me? Because see, I believe that when you die, if Jesus has to go to the Father for you, you're in trouble. Woo, you're in trouble. That means it's like a lawyer going to court and speaking up for you because, you know, anything about the courthouse, you go go for the judge. The lawyer tell you, let me handle this. Basically, if you ever realize, the defendant only say one thing in court, no two words, not guilty. His attorney says everything else. Why is that? Because he's an advocate for you. That's it. But if Jesus has to stand up for you on the day of Pentecost, I feel for your soul. Because that means all you're running has been in vain. But you said, I'm going to press towards the mark for a higher calling has been in vain. Your temporary layover has been in vain. It's funny how the devil can step right in. Because just when you thought it was over, PG, 
Think about what I'm saying. Just when you thought it was over, here come Jesus stepping in. Don't worry. December, that song going to ring in your ears. Just when you thought it was over, here come Jesus stepping in. Going through hell just to get to heaven. But I'm going to press on to see what the end is going to be. I'm going to press on to see what the end is going to be. And I tell you, I'm going to strike it up for you, Bobby. Because I remember being in friendship. Where we stand and say, I believe I run on. See what the end is going to be. I believe I run. 